Right, okay, as you see here, we've got the re we've got the actual recessed pieces just here. We've got the plain pieces here, and we're now going to go to the assembly sort of stage. So what we're going to need for that is we're going to need your glue. It can be PVA glue, uh, but I prefer the tacky glue. Um, I like to store this upside down so it's actually always constantly in the actual nozzle. Um, it just makes it easier to when I'm actually using it. So I'm going to give it a really generous coat just down the actual recess. I'm going to give it a little bit just down the actual side, just down here. And I'm going to go ahead and do this side. Nice generous piece there. Nice. You can always wipe off the excess with a finger. So I don't mind getting messy. <clears throat> so what I'm going to do here is match the tops up. So this one was a top piece. This is a top piece, that's the reason why we did that. So we get the right we get the right way and we're just going to stick them together. And what I like to do when I actually do this is I like to get a couple of pins, just dressmaking pins, and I like to actually pin the model. I don't put the pin all the way in, I'll leave a little overhang. The reason why I'm not actually using hot gun here guys is um, hot glue is going to leave like a line, like an over, an over line down the back and we're going to be seeing inside the actual building here so I don't want that actually shoving. If you're not particularly bothered about it, go ahead and go and glue gun it. And uh, so, as you can see there, I've pinned that one. And I'm going to put this one down here. So, as you can see there, and I'm just going to leave it. This gets everything nice and straight for us. And if we need to do any trimming later on, it holds the model in such a place where we can actually trim any excess off and everything's pretty much solid together so now for the next back side lining up the top and the bottom again so and what I will always tend to do is if it's one side is actually slightly smaller than the other I'll always line up the tops rather than the bottoms because it's more critical that we get the roof straight rather than the floor straight the reason that is we can adapt that to the actual, we can actually adapt the roof, uh, sorry, we can actually adapt the base to take the model. So it's unbelievably hot up here. It's, it's truly, truly hot. Whew, not used to the hot weather in, the Scot in Scotland, eh? So, putting the pins in, again, I'm going to need a couple more than two on this one. Some are just like that. So, here we go. So that's that's that bit. I'm just going to go and sort the wee man out because he's he's going mental once again. So I'll be back soon and when, he, when I come back this piece will be put in.